Hi, I'm Old Sneelock. Welcome to another episode of Old Sneelock's Workshop. Well, this is the bag. Full. Let's see if I can empty this thing while I'm holding the camera. Last year I grabbed it by the open end and towed it. And I might have put an extra strain on the bag when I did that. That's how many leaves the bag held. Still got some left in it. There we go. Now it's empty. That worked pretty well. That worked pretty well. Okay, I'm going to shorten this drag up a little bit so that uh, the bag rides on it a little better. All I did was tie it off there. So I'm just going to shorten up the cord. Around and hooked it on the tow hook that I used to tow the tarp around when I was raking all the leaves onto the tarp. So now I've got the bagger drag sheet shortened up. We'll put the bagger back on and we'll see where we go. I'm sh pretty sure that the skid would work better if it was wider. Uh, it does take a lot of the abuse, but when the, the tractor turns, the, the skid slides out from underneath the bag, especially when the bag's only partially full. Because when the bag's only partially full, it lifts up, it, in, it inflates and, and rides off to the left side because of the way the bagger goes over the top of the the way the bag goes over the top of the bagger uh, it doesn't seal completely that's why you see leaves blown all over me but it does pick up it's picking up good seems to be doing what I wanted it to do so I'm excited we're gonna dump this bag and carry on Bag's filling up. That whole thing's full of leaves now. It's not as heavy, which is good because I just want to have leaves. I don't want to pick up dirt. Last year I picked up a lot of dirt. But the dirt's going to be in this end. I'll be able to tell better when I lift this end up. That's not bad. Not anywhere near as bad as with last year. Last year I picked it up and it just tore right straight down the middle. Like making sausage.
And the idea is to get the bag, to get the leaves to decompose. Having them chopped up and mixed with dirt is a big plus. A lot of leaves picked up. Another thing that I can see being a problem, I need to make smaller loads. And I need to make smaller loads by starting out with a yard that's not quite as full of leaves. I worked on the workshop instead of working on leaves this year. So when it came time to do leaves, I was busy. Well, I was doing well, but then the belly blew out. That's okay. Like I said, I got a new one coming. It ripped in an old rip. It didn't rip in a new one. It didn't get torn. It ripped in a new spot. Well, it just tore loose on this seam here and went on down. So, it was a good run. Worked well while it lasted. But now she's all done. It slightly off. I think I'm going to have to take the blame for this. This bag is overfilled. I put too much in it. Yep. You got to mow your... You got to go through and pick up the leaves in smaller batches. You just can't go through that many leaves and expect it to last. That's a lot of leaves.
we'll just leave it in there for now. And I'll go on and finish the rest of the yard just using the bags. I got the most of the heavy stuff, which is probably the demise of this thing. It's, I went through too many. Well, for a piece of crap, it worked pretty good. I think it's because it's slippery. It doesn't catch on anything. I suppose I could claim that the paint reinforced it, but that'd be a little silly. Okay. Back to picking up leaves the old-fashioned way. This video is not to be viewed by anyone under the age of 13 in the U.S. or 16 in the European Union without the express written permission of the parents or the legal guardians of the underage person. Such written permission must be on file at the local government entity in charge of enforcing the rules and regulations established by the FTC. Anyone violating these terms is admitting by default that they hold harmless the owners and operators of this channel. Any and all questions should be addressed to your local branch of the FTC.